Terrors on high alert after a warning came out about someone targeting female agents showing homes. The Summit County Prosecutor's Office now investigating. Cole Molesky shares one woman's story. For one realtor in Summit County, this message is hitting close to home. I was trying to push him off and he wasn't, I just couldn't. Realtors are often isolated, showing properties on their own. This can lead to some harrowing situations. So he kind of dive tackled on top of me. So he had me trapped on the stairs from my feet all the way up, but I was holding myself up in the air. Earlier this week, an alert was sent to realtors across Summit County following an incident at an open house. Realtor Karen Hallman knows firsthand just how badly a showing can go. So I'm wiggling, 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 trying to get you know, every everything off I could and then um, finally I'd slipped free and I was running with my hands and he was like trying to grab my toes. Hallman says a man tried to kidnap her a decade ago while she was showing a house. Alerts like the one this week remind her why she takes extra precautions. I always take somebody with me, you know, just keep in shape so I can run and fight and fight my way out no matter what. Coleman is part of Adam Coleman's Remax Edge Realty team. He says they have a process to try and avoid solo showings, especially if it is a new client. Are you, is this somebody you dealt with before? Is this somebody new? And if they say, yeah, it's new, hey, did you see the bulletin? Do you want me to come over and open the door with that help? The prosecutor's office says they're looking into last week's incident, but are not releasing an ID at this time. I say just stay with, stay with somebody. In Akron, Colt Molesky, 19 News. Well, Akron has officially named its new police chief, and it's a familiar face. Brian Harding has been acting chief since former chief Steve Milet stepped down in December. Harding is a graduate of the University of Akron and has spent 28 years on the Akron police force in various positions, most notably as deputy chief. Harding's appointment comes after several months of public engagement. He'll be sworn in during the week of May 27th.